and here they come, the horses in the first division of the Little Brown Jug. These pacers will go two heats, and heat winners will come back to face horses, which have won heats in the other division. Number one is Inns and Lad, Benny Shoe and the Sulky. Then Jug Chief with Del Cameron. Meadow Gold with Del Miller. Earl's Ensign with Billy Houghton. Cimarron's Forbes with Dana Cameron. Diamond Howe with Joey O'Brien. Queen's Adios with Jimmy Hackett. And Phantom Lady with Frank Irvin. Diamond Howell and Queen's Adios are co-favored at two to one. Phantom Lady, who equaled the world's Philly record here earlier in the week, is third choice at just over two to one. And here they come. Starter Riley Couch gets them off smartly, and in the first turn, it's Joe Chief along the rail with Earl Zenzin and Queen's Adios on the outside. In the back stretch, Wayne Zedios moves up to take the lead from Jug G. Diamond Howell is moving on the outside, but he can't make the top. Jug Chief is third, and Earl Zenzin fourth. Diamond Howe keeps going and makes the head end as they come through the stretch the first time. They have to go twice around this half mile track to cover the standard mile distance. The last horse is Phantom Lady, but she's beginning to move now. Meadow Gold goes off straight on the outside as Queen's Adios moves up to take the lead. Phantom Lady is still coming on as Diamond Hal begins to tire. Ensign Lad is also moving. Phantom Lady moves out for a momentary challenge, but then tucks back into the two hole for a breather. Billy Houghton is right there with Earl's Ensign. And here comes Phantom Lady again. It's Phantom Lady coming on the outside to win it by a lane. And here she is, back in the winner's circle, Phantom Lady, illustrious daughter of Volamite, who has yet to lose a race this year, although she's dropped a couple of heats. Phantom Lady paid 660 to win and paced her mile in 2-1 and 2 fifths, equaling the world's half-mile track record for Phillies, which she established here earlier this week. Phantom Lady was bred and is owned by the Walnut Hall Farm of Donrail, Kentucky, and has been trained and driven throughout her career by the veteran Frank Irvin. Queen's Adios finished second and ends in lad third.